30 seconds to go. Here comes the place kicking unit. Brandon what? Talton Heck yeah. will attempt a 56 yard field goal to win it from the far hash. First of all, we, we huddled up. We, we did a prayer, I led us in prayer, man. We were just excited to be in that moment. So field goal went out there and um, I just remember like locking in and um, I pulled Brandon aside and he had to look in his eye, I already knew he was gonna make it. And I just told him, man, like, go be a hero right now. Go, go win this game for us. Brandon Talton out of the hole to Fossum. 56 yards to win it. So in, whenever you like you step on the field, you know you're focused when you can't hear anything. Like, you can't hear the crowd, like, it was loud to you. It's one shot, one kill, and it's purely mechanical with him. It's not emotional, it's purely mechanical. Talton, a true freshman from Vacaville High School, Vacaville, California. 56 yards to win it, a 31-31 tie. I mean, I can't imagine what was going through his head. You know, I mean, he was probably, you know, preparing, he wanted to play, and then you get the shot. And then it comes down, your first college game comes down to a game winning field goal and of that caliber. I was just in the zone. I was just focused, me, Foss, everyone like just focused. And Purdue at Nevada, out of the hold of Fossum. Good snap, spotted. The kick is up. The kick is on the way. The kick is good. The kick is good. Nevada beats Purdue. I was looking at it and I was just watching it go through, right? Just like imagining in my head and I'm just going through and uh, it was still in the air, it hasn't gone through yet. And I just remember like seeing Foss take off his helmet jumping up and down and I was like like you see in the film like I was like looking back and forth between him and the ball because I was like you're celebrating the ball hasn't gone through yet. I knew it was in before him you know I, I felt it off the off his foot and I knew it was going in and I didn't even say anything I just tackled him I freaked out he was still waiting for it to go and I'm glad we didn't get a penalty I ripped my helmet off a little early but um, it was just there was no words to be said it was just a moment that we just all knew was going to be uh, remembered forever. Ring the steeple bells and blow the trumpets! It was just kind of a blur after, and I just remember Perry, um, when they all picked me up and stuff, he was like, you're a legend, like, you great job, like, all this stuff. And then um, seeing all the fans rush the field, my teammate picked me up, like, my teammates picking me up, and, yeah, just, like, hugging everyone. What's going through my mind is to survive, because I, I got to him first, and I hugged him up, and then the, you know, then the, the, and then it kind of dawned on me, like, oh, that was dumb, um, because, you know, swarms of 300 pound guys are jumping on top of you. So I was on all fours trying to protect him. And, uh, you know, people were piling up on me and Brandon's underneath me and I'm like this. And I'm thinking, you know, this is the way I go out. That's a pretty good way to go out. The greatest win at Mackey Stadium since the Boise Dream came here to die in 2010. But not least, Steve, yeah. yeah, he's from Vacaville. He's from Vacaville. Scully! Congratulations, outstanding game ball and scholarship. Yeah, I was in all like this happened to me. Like you see this on TV, you see this happen to a bunch of other people. Like this happened from someone from Vacaville, like like me. Like just came here as a walk on. Like all this stuff happened, and um, just crazy seeing that. Like. Like, you, like obviously like these stories happen with other people, they've gotten scholarships and all that, and, um, and that to see it happen to me is just crazy to me, like, to think, so. Brandon, um, Brandon is a, is a tremendous person. I think it's hard to be a really consistent kicker if you're not a consistent person. Um, you gotta have a really strong moral and fiber uh, to go out and do the things that he does, particularly at the young age that he is. But what he has done and what he is doing right now is, is amazing and it's incredible.